Hi, I'm Adam from DoodleDrama.com. Today we're going to be using the scale animator. Now, the scale animator is going to mainly makes your text sort of just seem a bit more active and animated, and that's what this is all about. The adding these animators. Uh, if you have missed the previous blog about adding the text opacity animator, you might want to just check that out in case I miss anything as I go over this. I'll try to make it as easy to follow as I can. But the next few effects are going to kind of be linked together, which is why I'm using the same project file. And the, all together they had a really nice effect. To add the um, scale animator, we just simply go down here to the layer options. This is the animator one for the opacity. There's a little add thing, you, you click on that, and then from the pop out menu, go to property and you just select the scale animator. And you just get an extra line down here with two values on it. Now, if you make the value less than 100, I'll just go down to. 50 text will start small and as you can see it sort of builds up and it sort of pops out which can be quite a nice effect or you can make it higher than 100% and it will stop big sort of jump up and then sit back down and I, I quite like that one so I'm, I'm going to use that one but I'm going to set it about 145% you get sort of quite a nice little effect of the text popping up and sitting down and there you have it that's the scale animator um, tomorrow I'm going to show you how to add the rotate effects to the text which can just finish it off and makes it look very professional. I've been Adam from DoodleNoDrama.com and I've just shown you how to add the text scale animator to your text in Photoshop. This isn't Photoshop, it's, it's After Effects. I, I know that. <laughs>